finals of the Dream Chemistry Award, and we will see five guys from all over the world who uh, boldly go when no one has gone before, because they dream. From Massachusetts Institute of Technology, United States of America. Especially for this occasion, so I'm very excited to tell you about my dream. And my dream is to create universal catalysts. And, and I'll explain to you how we go about that and why I, I decided to go after this. Uh, Eric Daniel Głowacki uh, uh, from the Johannes Kepler uh, University in Linz. My dream is that we can find materials in nature, molecules in nature, that can self-assemble into supermolecular structures which support conductivity, electrical conductivity, and can be tuned to have biomimetic shape. So we can have certain size and shape in order to mimic, for example, structures in a cell, structures in a tissue, even on the scale of an organism, and actually interact electronically or optoelectronically with biology. My dream is to find the, the right molecule for, for every patient, the molecule which suits exactly this person, which relieves uh, immediate symptoms, but also provides uh, long-term recovery, prolongs life, and improves the life uh, quality. Yogesh Surendranath from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, United States of America. The dream is to tackle what I would argue is one of the most important challenges for humanity right now, uh, which is to find a way of getting clean, renewable energy uh, that can be used in a current infrastructure that's highly dependent on fossil fuels. The finalist is Yayin Yuan from the Max Planck Institute in Germany. And Earth is truly unique in its abundance of water. This is a photo of uh, our planet taken by the NASA satellite, um, Suomi National Polar Orbiting Partnership, launched in October 28, 2012. And, and the winner is... You are the winner. 